Evcart Custom Upsell. In this video, we're gonna cover how to display content conditionally, whether somebody bought the upsell or not for a Thrivecart product. Now, for this to work, we're gonna use the Thrivecart success page, not a custom URL, and below there is the link you need to go to to get the code we're gonna use. And this is what it looks like. Where you see the word yes and no, we're gonna make appropriate substitutions. So let's dive right in. Inside your Thrivecart account, you wanna have a product, Go to Fulfillment. You want to make sure it's Display Their Total Invoice. And then in Checkout, you're going to need to use one of the new carts. I'm using the Sales cart. So I'm going to go into the Design section and launch the editor. Doesn't matter what you do here, it's the success page that matters. So we are no longer going to use their content or their content capabilities. For instance, this video. Um, I did, I clicked on this video button, dragged it over, dropped the embed code right in there. We're gonna do it our own way. So I need to delete this. And instead, I wanna drag the custom HTML block over and put it where I want it. And so in this case, I'm gonna display a video or another video depending on whether they bought the upsell or not. Let's take a look at the code we have. So there it is. So if they take the upsell, we wanna put something in here. I'm gonna put the embed code for a video. And this one is what we're going to use. So I'm going to go here, click on share, go to the embed code. But I'm going to go ahead and use this. I'm going to copy that code. If they take the upsell, I want to show that video. And I've just dropped in where the, where the word yes was. And we're going to use this video if they don't take the upsell. So I'm going to go back. Here. And that's going to go in place of no. So now I want to copy all of this and go back to Thrivecart. And inside here, I need to paste in the embed code. And that's it. Click on done. We can save and exit and save and get URL. Let's go ahead and make a purchase. So in this case, I'm going to say no thanks and not take the upsell. Now I want to do a purchase where I take the upsell. Okay, I'm going to take the upsell this time. And there, I've got a different video when I took the upsell versus when I didn't. So that's how you can customize the Thrivecart success page depending on whether somebody took the upsell or not.